your character, you know, uh, we start off seeing you in the first episode. Can you tell us a little bit about um, your relationship with Brendan? Yes, so uh, Brendan and I were together uh, previously, when you d which you don't see in the show. Um, and then, without giving too much away, um, I, I have a new encounter with him in the first episode of the show. And um, he's someone that I really like, um, but he kind of took advantage of me. And um, it just really catalyzes the whole entire plot line of his, his uh, view and treatment of women. So. And so obviously this entire show is about Brendan's mom, Eve. Um, what do you, do you think anything about the father or the son-mother relationship like plays into the way that he treats women? Like why he treats women that way? I think it really plays into the fact that he grew up with pornography in his life. I mean, obviously Eve is figuring that out right now, but I mean, I think a big issue in society is men's treatment of women come from what they see in porn. Um, so that's where I really think it comes from. I, don't, I wouldn't make it, I wouldn't say that she was a bad mother at all. Oh, right. Um, but yeah, I just think that they just never really had the conversation and he never really asked and she never really answered. So, um, of course then, if you have no other sisters or other women like that in your life, then what are you going to look at for those examples? That's going to be what you what you watch. So, Your scenes were very interesting to watch because, it, you know, you want to be a strong, independent female and tell the guy, you know, what's up and to treat women correctly. But then you come back. So why do you think it is for the younger generation right now that women feel, young women feel as though they need to kind of of feed into that still, even though they want to stand up for themselves? I think it's just all, we're all craving connection more so than ever, even though we are more connected than ever with social media. I just think that that's just a basic human need. And even though we have all this social media, you still crave that even more. Everyone feels so distant. And so I think that it was just her, um, you know, she, even though she was being hard to him in the beginning when they meet back up again, um, she she gives in because she's just like she wants that and she needs it at the same time. But it's hard. I mean, it's it's a thing that I think a lot of women face, um, especially as a young teen. It's just like you want to be liked and admired and you want to be connected to somebody. And if they open that window back up again, then it feels like that's right. And it may not always be so. Mm -hmm.